year six. God, you're six years in already. Ugh, ugh. Welcome to my personal rain cloud. I was never very good at math, since I have only three fingers on each hand. And here you don't actually have to do no merry very much about math to complete these assignments. They're good. That's good for me. For each two things in the inbox, add them together and put the result in the outbox. Right. So you've got a new command. It adds yeah, the contents of the I'm tile on the floor to whatever value bit. you're currently holding. So similar to the last one, except we add them together. Yeah. But I imagine I'll probably have to put them both on the carpet. Is that? No, I might just be able to grab them. Shouldn't I? Yeah. All right, let's give it a go. Inbox. So we're grabbing number two. Yeah. We're gonna copy it to position zero. Yeah. Inbox. Yeah. Add to position zero. Yeah. Uh, no, not copy two. Damn it! Get out of here. Just drag it up. Okay. Cool. Uh, copy from zero into the outbox. Now, why do you want to copy from? The number that is going to be on zero. Because I've so let's run through this. I grab number two from the inbox. Yeah. Put it on zero. Yeah. Yeah. Then I grab the next one, number eight, from the inbox. Yeah. Add it to zero, so that'll be ten. Yeah. Yeah, but that doesn't go on the tile. What it do you mean? Be in your hand. Ah, see, I didn't know that bit, so I don't need to copy it from. And just chuck it straight in the outbox. Yep. And I then, thought it'd replace. I get you. Yeah. And then you got to do it for, for each, each two one. things. So we want to jump back to the start. Yep. Give that a go. So two into there. Chuck that one away. Eight. Add them together. I see. Into the outbox. Seven. Put it there. Nine. Add to seven. Chuck it in the outbox. Minus four, chuck it there. Add that to three. Into the outbox. Nine, into there. Minus one, to that. Into the outbox. And there you go, that, that's how simple it is when you think see, about yeah. the process. Cool. Now, if we go backwards <coughs> a little bit. To. Oh, actually, it hasn't bought them up yet, so we'll go okay. to the we'll go to the tripler room. Tripler room. Yeah, these are extra yeah, ones eight. you can do. I see. Who are you? This optional area is for high-performing employees only. Is that you? Well, you're late. <laughs> Seven years late. We need to make some changes around here. I want to see a hundred percent performance increase. From this point on, your performance will be evaluated with extra scrutiny. What does that mean? <laughs> As in, is now unlocked the extras. So if you click on it before we read that, click click on about that. the tripler room, it tells you about optimization challenges. This one. Yep. Use six or fewer commands. Completing 24 or fewer steps. So it's like the OCD in World of Goo and the Got extra you. bits in Little right. Inferno. So are you able to keep an eye on what challenge we, challenges we've got? Yes, I can do that indeed. Marvellous. Is it worth talking to her anymore? You can get her to give you an example. Right. So you're tripling the amount of each thing. Okie dokie. I think I get it. I think I get it. I don't know if I'll be able to do the OCD sort of stuff, but I think I get it. So we want to grab from the inbox first of all. Mm -hmm. We want to copy it to zero. Yes. We want to copy it to one. We also want to copy it to two. Does sound good? Sounds good if you're going to do it a long-winded way, but I'll, I'll leave you to okay. it. Bear in mind it said six steps, but I know you're not an optimization challenge <laughs> person, whereas I am. Right. Yeah. Oh, I can do this. 
you can work this out, you're clever enough. Grab it from the inbox. Yep. So we've got a six in our hand. Mm-hmm. He doesn't get rid of it until he goes back to the inbox. Exactly. So if I copy it to zero. Yeah. Then add it to zero. Then add it to zero. That should triple it. Yeah. Well, work it out. You you put a six down on the zeros tile. So six, add six, add six. It's triple. Into the inbox, outbox. Yeah, and then. And then do the same for everything. Yes. So we got one, two, three, four. Oh, it's got numbers next to it. There you go, six commands. That should be our thing, yeah? Yep. Boom. Try that. Six. Add them together. Add them together. Bung it in there. Minus five. Add it together. Add it together. Bung it in there. Same with four. Shibadoo. Shibadoo. Boff. Zero, add it to zero, add it to zero. Is zero. <laughs> but yes, that is exactly Boom. correct and spot on. Yes. Boom. You can see how hard I've been working on getting these puzzles down. Yeah. Oh. I see, so it's sort of setting me up for the whole... Yeah. Yeah, now everything's got that. Yeah, so you see the busy so mailroom, there is a mail room. second solution. So let's go back to this and just have a quick look. Because it will say from now on at the bottom that some <coughs> of these can't be done, like completed optimised wise, without right. doing two solutions. Okay. So you've got the three or fewer commands, but say you haven't done the 25 or fewer steps because yeah. you can't do that in three or fewer commands. So I'm going to need two things, and this is yep. there seems to be tabs up here. Yep, so use a second tab, so you always yep. keep your first one. So what did we need to do from here? Just straight up into out? Yeah. We need to do it in 30 or less steps, is that right? Yes. And no, 25 or less, and we took 30 doing it the way we did. Yeah. Huh. So how am I supposed to do that? What was that? Yeah, we just did inbox, outbox, jump. How do we make that more optimised? Well, when you times that by 8... Yeah. 8, 6, 4, plus you've got the extra jumps there. Yeah. So that, that little box there counts as jump right at the start. Right, so we got one So command, technically there's four one, steps. Two, well, no, it's three, if we go by the other one. It only counted six, even ah, though that, that's three commands, but that means four steps. Right, I see. So you grab from the inbox one step, take it to the outbox two steps, you jump back three steps, then you take from the inbox four steps. Yes. I think I get you. So inbox, outbox, jump, but if we put another couple in there, that should take out a couple of steps every process. Is that going to work? Um, that might work. I've done it I'm a bit, a, a bit more of Go a long-winded way. So you've just done it one each, is that right? No, I worked out on how many tiles you get. So like there's eight tiles. Yeah. So I split it in half. So, right, do, you, so, do you want my second solution? Or was it, work it, was out? it along the line of what I was doing? Yeah, it was along the line of what so you were doing. So, inbox outbox times two times three times four, then jump. Yes. Go. Go first. That was not eight. <laughs> no, it wasn't. There's more of them this time. Yeah. Let's see, though. But that should do it. So, we've got that. We've not got that one. But we have on our other tab. And we've got that one. Ha <laughs> ha! 
So, as you can see at the bottom, it does <coughs> say these challenges can be very difficult and in many yeah. cases not possible to optimise both simultaneously with one solution. Got it. And sometimes I don't think people take that into consideration, so they try ding, and do ding. it all at so once. We've done both. Yeah. And I noticed some had three tabs, so I'm guessing up here somewhere there's going to be somewhere three up, three things to do. Maybe, I'm not sure yet. I, do, I don't want to scroll see. any further off. Yeah, fair enough. Because I don't want to ruin it for myself. I see, so your first blinking light is your size, and the yep. second one is your speed. A, B equals C, of course. Yep. 